I did not get a new Honda CRV. <sighs> Unfortunately, someday I'm gonna get a new car. This is my mom's car, as I mentioned in yesterday's vlog when we had the Ross Hall and the date night. Um, my mom is in New York, so I'm gonna fire it up to uh, make sure the battery doesn't die while she's traveling, visiting family in New York. Love you, family in New York, in case you're watching. Here we go. But I just remembered the mail keys are on my other keys. Woo! Glad I remembered that. Holy smokes, that would have been sad. All right, let's go get the key. Something arrived in the mail! Woohoo! I'm not gonna open it yet. I'm gonna go home, open it with true love. Okay, here we are. True Love rocked it today at Trader Joe's. Um, and we were talking last night or the day yeah. before that every family, for their shopping, has to figure out what works for them. Mm -hmm. And that includes the grocery store and the most important part of shopping, eating. Uh, what results is the eating. Yeah. So, you went to Trader Joe's and you're going to give some tips. Yes. Right? I, and, I'm just kind of explain what, what we get and why. What's going on here? And just a quick quick clarifier we have our all of our meat we buy our meat at Costco but go check out this vlog <laughs> we got a fourth of a cow for free a fourth of a cow a fourth of a fourth a fourth of an eighth no no an eighth of a fourth an eighth of a fourth of a cow we got a lot of <laughs> got meat. a lot of meat and so we just I've been able to buy a lot more fun stuff with that extra 15 bucks every week because awesome. and what we do is we budget a hundred dollars per week for our family so which would include meat and normally I do 85 at Trader Joe's and $15 at Costco. Yeah. Okay, so just to give you a little thing, the first thing I will share with you was the thing we were, I was most excited about because I already broke into it and made it for lunch for everybody, but it's this sliced French brioche bread. Oh, nice. And their black forest ham, which normally I don't ever buy their lunch meat. It's like per ounce, not as cheap as Costco, but they had this sample last year when they were doing this and then Swiss cheese, and you make your own to die for grilled cheese oh my gosh. sandwich. Yeah. Amazing. So you, we actually made you one, and Seth Sebastian ate yours. Oh, he, he really did. It. I know. That boy doesn't eat. I knew you would be okay with it, and I'm gonna make you another one. I'm perfect. So that, and also for lunch, we had these um, nacho, it's their Dorito version of chips, and it, they're Doritos very are my good. They yeah. are. Oh, I had some. Right, don't they taste yeah. like Doritos? Yeah. So this was the first time we've ever whoop, had that. Got it. Um, okay, some other things we got for the fall, the apple cider, and yeah. it's very good, plain, cold, um, or heated up. So once a week I do this little tea time with the kids, and I, I thought I would do this, with heat this up, and then we always have some yummy cookies. So this is part of their pumpkin nice. months of stuff. And then I got, we've had these before, they're delicious, so I got another box because we're taking uh, dinner over to some friends of ours who just had twin boys, mm. and then this is gonna be their dessert. Love you, Josh and Maggie. Yeah, so precious. Um, okay, I don't know if you've ever tried their soups, Soups in a box, obviously it's the soup in a box, but their soups in a box are amazing. The real deal. And I got the this to deal. eat with the grilled cheese, but I forgot about it. So we can have that for Grilled lunch. cheese and tomato soup is basically one of my favorite meals. Mine too. Remember and our first date? You made that for me? With pickles. Our, with pickles. I love pickles. On the grilled cheese. <laughs> that's, a, that's another story for another day. Uh, but this is the real deal. Yes. Delicious. And they also have another flavor with red pepper is good. Okay, Fritos, Schmitos. Get your Fritos out of your house and get yourself to Trader Joe's because it's their version of Fritos. Don't you think these are like 10 times better uh -huh. than the Fritos? They're Hardier. just thicker. Yeah, yeah, they're thicker and they're so good with anything. But this is the new dip for the week. Oh, and yummy. we've had this before and you, this is really good on sandwiches or to dip your chips in Cilantro soup. and chive yogurt dip. Yes. Yeah. And then just a dozen eggs. As you all know, you always got to check your eggs. Boom. And nor Good looking egg. I know, normally I just buy the cheapy dollar eggs, but lately I've been able to taste the difference now that I'm pregnant between good and, you know, organic and not Someday organic. we might have chickens, you never know. Oh, uh, that'd be fun. <sighs> oh, I didn't get the shoot, sorry. Honey crisp apples. We'll tell you, these are $1.29 per apple. 
And as you know, I think per pound, they're normally really expensive. And we think each of these might be a pound. Yeah. They're it's so heavy. big. Well, maybe we'll weigh it and film that. And you can um, pick, everything's sold individually. So like bananas are 19 cents each. Yeah. Every piece of produce. But then you can go in and pick the biggest ones. So put these, we got these last week and they were just, yeah, divine. Okay, I'll set these up here. Amazing. And watching the vlog for a while, you know that we are on a budget all the time. And, uh, but if you're new, welcome, which there's a bunch of you. Holy yeah, oh, smokes. Yeah, welcome to the fam. Yeah, so, I mean, there's like a bunch of you coming on board. I might have to wait on this. Yeah, okay. I don't wanna. So. We're just filming, hang on one, one sec. second. So the reason we are on a budget and we're able to stay on budget yeah. is because of a tip and trick from True Love that centers around these two pieces oh. of paper. So maybe explain this. Okay. So I always, before I go, I always meal plan and I always check what I have on hand to use, like not forgetting the good meats we have. But especially since I go to Trader Joe's every single week, I really just started to pay attention to what the prices are and how much everything costs. So before I go, I write down everything I need plus how much my guess is that it's gonna cost. And that way I know I'm gonna stay under budget. Now, then when I get back home, and also when you get up to the cash register, you know, and can, you, can they see that the price on that was $98? You'll have to wait one minute. $98.75. So when I get back home, I just quickly scan through this, make sure I wasn't double charged, which has only happened twice in my life at Trader Joe's. It can't happen though. Yeah, it can. And there was one, two, three, four items that I was wrong on. Three of them I was budgeted over like this guy because I never bought it before. And then one I was under. So now looking at that, comparing it back here, I crossed it off and now I'm gonna pitch this, but now I know spices basically are two bucks at Trader Joe's. So it just helps me know in my mind how much I can get for the money in the bank, the cash in my wallet. Crushed it. And that's our Trader Joe's that's all. Yeah. Thank you, everybody, for uh, yeah, you partaking. Oh, Where the day is not done. Today? By the way, this is a vlog. Oh, wait, we did forget one. Oh, what did we forget? The Holly, Holly Ooh, Oreos. One more thing. So the kids today, we love, I'm kind of like buying all sorts of stuff I never buy because I want it too, because I'm pregnant. But um, they asked for this Halloween Trader Joe's Oreos, and we said yes. And they had it with their tea today, and they really, did you guys like it? Yeah. Yeah, they love yeah. it. Now, let's focus on my action. Okay, tell us when to, to cut. Hun, you look so good. Okay, okay. cut. Yeah, that sounds right. <laughs>